Okay, everyone, this is an extremely large home right here. I can't wait to show you everything. Thank you so much for clicking on the video. My name is Chance. If this is your first time seeing the channel, we've got all types of home tours on here. So be sure to check out the channel after this tour. This is a home manufactured by Sunshine. I absolutely love touring their homes because everything's always really, really nice, upgraded. You see, we got some nice looking hardy here. With stone around the front door, half beveled glass front door, by the way, not just any front door. This home right here has a really, really big den in it, or like a, it could be set up for a lot of stuff. I can't wait for y'all to see that, but it, you could also turn this home, you can make that into a bedroom is what I'm trying to say. I'm at Town & Country Homes here today. Thankfully, they let me come video some of their amazing inventory. This is one of them. We're finna get right into it. I wanna show you one quick thing on the back side. Then we're gonna head on in. But while we're walking back there, let's admire this beautiful sign. And also, if you have not, I'm gonna encourage you to hit that like button for us. That just, well, not just for us, it's just me. But if you would do that, that really helps these videos out a lot. But here's what I wanna show you. This is a show model, by the way. That's why the underpinning stops and everything. They'll just order off of this. I think most of y'all know that, but I wanna stress that in case you're a new viewer but we've got water hookup, some plug, a plug here on the back, but not only do we have a back door, we have these sliding doors here. And that whole setup right, on, right there on the inside of that is super sweet. Okay, I think I've ran my mouth enough. Let's check it out. Did I mention this home has a half glass? Just kidding. Yeah. He's got the pipes on that truck. Goodness gracious, I'm trying to shoot a video, Steve. All right, it's showtime, ladies and gentlemen. Let's make it happen. Well, you just can't walk in this home and not give you that wow view. Like a lot of times I try to save that kitchen uh but you just i had to just look at the vaulted ceilings i just noticed that that is nice we'll get right into that i do want to quickly pan this living room for you just to show you the size of it do my best to try to have a floor plan at the beginning i always do but a lot of times when i'm recording at that time i really don't know which is like right now, I'm not 100% sure I can locate one, but I, don't, I think with Sunshine, I think it'll be no problem. They typically have most of that stuff on their website. So yes, let's go ahead and come across. Like I said, down there, some cool stuff, but I'm not gonna, I keep getting so ahead of myself. Wow, these beams and the way this ceiling is like vaulted, that, I can also say I've never seen that. I mean, or maybe it's been in some holes. I hadn't even noticed it, I guess, but that was like the first thing that caught my attention. So I don't see how that could be the case. But anyways, we've got this extra long island right here. All these cabinets, I like the color. These, we have like a gray and then we have a white here. Looks good. And then the, the black countertops here with the white countertops on here. They did a lot of customization in this home. Looks great. Come over here, you got the ceramic tile, backsplash. You know, that looks wonderful. I like, I say it every time I see it, but I'll say it again today. I like having these windows right here on the back side. That way, uh, you know, you're looking back. If you have you some nice land, maybe a pond out there or something like that, but you have these windows that, op that can open up. The LG stainless steel appliances, I love the appliances that Sunshine puts in their homes. They're really nice. Soft clothes, cabinets is what you're gonna see in pretty much any Sunshine, I would think. Pretty much everyone I've toured, I've seen that. And this right here would be a, this is a coat closet. <laughs> Just kidding, this is a pantry. Um, it's not really a walk-in. So, unfortunately, 
I don't have my pantry dance shirt on, but even if I did, it wouldn't feel right doing it because the pantry dance is only for walk-in pantries. Y'all know that. What a very wide setup right here. If you, I hope this shot right here is coming in as good as it is right here in person. And I know I've already mentioned, but once again, this island, the length of that, what is that? 10, probably, that's probably longer than 10 foot, maybe. I don't know, I really, I'd just be guessing, but I'd say 10 to 12. Sliding glass doors, you remember? We've got those and a back door, and I'll show you that uh, back door setup is pretty cool. We got some more cabinets right here. I like the little arch that we have. Your dining area is very, very nice. Now this table is, is just for staging purposes, but it looks good in this home. Whoever does their staging, clap, 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 clap. It looks great. Have I showed you a shot of a flooring yet? Okay, check this out. So this is the back door, besides the sliding door. And here is your utility room. Now, you're probably thinking like, well, chances it's just a it's just a regular utility room. You know, well, it does have a sink. Let's think about that. That's a plus. Plus a really nice faucet. That's gonna that, that's the same one we've seen in there in the kitchen. Spot for your washer and dryer. But what I like about it is that you have this back door. Hear me out right here. Have this back door. Maybe you have a garage, maybe you don't, I don't know, but if you do. This actually goes into a bathroom. So think about that. If you need, if somebody needs to come in, use the restroom, they don't have to go all through your house or whatever. I think that's amazing. That's just, that's just chance, chance knowledge. You know, that's just, that's just stuff that your everyday person is not thinking about, but I tour homes for a living, y'all. <laughs> no, I really have learned a lot along the way, but that's, that is, that is notable. I mean, that's awesome. Head down this hall. There's that coat closet. Check out this room. I, I noticed that they went with the same floor in here. Mighty big room too. What usually happens in, check out the baseboards. Nice and, and the crown molding. What usually happens is uh, when you get a home, wow, with this many bedrooms, your rooms start decreasing in size. But hopefully I've got some measure, bedroom measurements and you'll see that's not the case here. Well, since we're here, let's go ahead and look at this bedroom. <laughs> Same thing here, you guys. Very, very large bedroom. back out here into the hall. And is this gonna be, so we've got another, this one has more uh, shelves in it. This could be like a linen closet or it could just be a storage closet. And now we're gonna take a look into this bath. Very big shove that we have over here. It really is, seriously, y'all. That is, that is extremely large. And then this is that door. Let me open it up just so you can see in there. Nothing just crazy about this, this guest bathroom, but that right there makes everything for me. I mean, it changes everything. Head out into the, oh my gosh, did y'all see that? Let's look in this bedroom first. So this bedroom, my goodness. I actually, at the time of recording, I'm not sure the square footage on this home. I just know it's really big. Wow. The 
another exceptional nice closet. Now, I know y'all caught a glimpse of this over here, so let's check it out. This is set up as a den. Like I was telling you, this home could be made into a five bedroom version if you needed a fifth bedroom. But then this down here on the other end with the stone and this fireplace, this is cool. That's what I'm talking about, this is a setup. All right, now let's go down here, finish this video up, show you this main bedroom. Let's check it out. It's crazy how big these rooms are in this house. You would think if you have four bedrooms and then you have a huge den, you're gonna lose some, some space somewhere. Don't be us <laughs> peeking in that closet. Should we start with the closet for the bath, before the bath? We might as well since you've already got a glimpse of it, okay. Look how big this is. Oh my gosh. Oh, now you're seeing the tub. Now we got light too. Look, look at the size of this closet. This is a mansion. I just did a, a very, a lot smaller double wide. And then coming into this, it's like, wow. It's, it's totally different. double racks and then all, and then you got your single rack down there. Ladies, I know the single racks for your dresses. I mean, you could just line them up, one in every color. Okay. Now we're finna look at this bathroom and it is something very special. Of course, I had to hold it out to the end. Okay. We walk in, we've got double sinks, Got the white countertops they went with in here. Recessed lighting. Everything looks so clean and crisp. It's one thing I've noticed about this whole home. And then if you turn, oh, get one to catch up. There it is. Yeah, you've, I know you've done seen a shot of that, so I'm gonna show you the full thing. First, let me show you the water closet. This is a very nice tub. You got the wand there. I love what they went with the wood, the shiplap around it, where it's not just sheetrock. Looks great. And then that right there goes into that closet that we just came out of. Now look at this. I have seen the five bedroom version of this home, and I, but I can't remember, like it was totally different colors, totally so much difference, but I can't really remember what the main bathroom looked like. This is, I wanted to get a close up of that. See how beautiful that is? There is that bench a lot of y'all like to see. There's definitely gotta be somebody that you can share this video with. I would really, really appreciate it if you would take the time to do that. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not. Hit that notification bell. We post on here every single week. At this point, I'm touring all types of stuff. So, I mean, if you wanna see just some interesting home tours, subscribe. And lastly, I'll ask you if you have not, hit that like button for us. That really helps these videos out a lot. If you would take the time to do that, I would appreciate it so much. Thank you. Okay everyone, so okay everyone, so I'm gonna try to be really brief here on the outro, talk about a couple important things. 
and then we'll, then we'll head on out. I wanna go over some ballpark pricing on this house. I wanna go over maybe if you're looking for this home, how I can help you find it. And then I wanna also talk about the video coming out next. And which one should we do first? Also to make sure you see my new shirt, I wore it in the last video, the last outro. It says, do the, no, it says do the, do, it should say the, do, I'm just kidding. It should say do the pantry dance. And that's basically, it's like a one, all right, I'm gonna stop messing around. Let me say in the description below, you can find more information on this house. As always, every video, always look in there, try to keep some important information. Also, we have our website link in the description. This is what I'm talking about. If y'all are watching these videos and you're like, I would love to be able to find that home. The only downfall is I'm in, let's say, Tennessee. This is in Mississippi. Or what if you're like, you're like, I'm in Oklahoma. How am I gonna be able to purchase a house that's in Mississippi? Well, we use our website links in the description below. We have built that to try to help do our best. And I can't 100% guarantee that I can help you, but help you find this home or something like it in your area. The best way to do that is go to our website links in the description below. We have a lot of people every single week using it. And if you're in the same situation, I encourage you to do that as well. Now, before I talk about these ballpark figures, let me talk about Saturday night's video. I know I mentioned it some in the last video. You guys, this will be the biggest home I've ever toured. I think total the house is like 6,300 square foot. And, and I know it's a little bit outside of my ordinary content, but it's something that I wanna start doing a little bit more of just because it's so much fun and it's just beautiful to look at. I mean, whether you may be realistically looking for like a, you know, 1500 square foot single wide or something, that's all you need. It's perfect. But even still like the video Saturday night, it'll be so much fun just to see it. And you know, just like, just like look at it and be like, wow, that's crazy. Or that's what I think. Y'all be sure to check it out and give me some feedback on that as well. So Saturday night for sure, definitely come back 6.45 Central Time. Now pricing on this particular house is just gonna be ballpark figures like I've already mentioned. These prices are just prices that have been provided to me. Y'all know I do these tours for entertainment, been doing that since day one, but I do wanna give you some type of pricing, some type of idea. Now, with that being said, I can't account for exactly where you're at, knowing if there could be other freight charges that are gonna be uh, added to from the manufacturer or the delivery crew. There could be other county regulations that I can't account for. This is not like lot prep and stuff like that. This would just be delivered and set up and like your AC, stuff like that. But with all that in mind, let me once again stress it's just the average range, okay? And if you're watching on down the road, pricing has probably changed. But right here up above us, you're gonna be seeing this price and this, my friends, we'll give you a really good idea what you can get this home for. Now I'm gonna dance on out of here, not pantry dance, but just, <laughs> I hope to see y'all back Saturday night, 6.45. The videos come out Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. I hope every one of you have a blessed day. Thank you all so much for continuing to support the channel. It means so much. I, I'm so very thankful for each one of you. I will see you Saturday night. See ya.